Uh, this is a new piece. Um, it's called Pick Up Alley, based on actual events in show world New York City. Those bodies enjoyed the veneration of the insanely devout. It's time to generate a performance on the dark, on the sunlight in between. Want to be free of this shit. This was a platform for wild visuals whimpering at the exquisite hips, pressing another face against forgotten wishes. Even more heroes are cowards. These were the films that spoke. She repeated herself, I want you to use the strange electricity conjured from within, confident we will continue as two still lies. Just trying to promise the elimination of creative control, fingers were directing this first feature, spotlighting tummies and thighs. She realized that this atmosphere had become so stimulating, so deadly. Kiss me. Energized by mutual pain, they hid in the dark doorways, unable to talk, alert today for a dead tomorrow. She performed research with the human re remains from Neolithic eras, fueled by cannabis and LSD darkness. She screamed not out of fear, but as a result of tactile pleasures. She stared at the skull and felt herself breathing in a distant region, looking back upon herself. She was greeted with quizzical stares. I wish I was kissing me. I put the car in drive and went back to see the guys tied together. It was the next thing I knew it was finished. Beauty books, such a bore, thrown back into her tortured faces without getting the heebie-jeebies. Historian and philosopher of the dead, tumbled backwards from the setting sun. Focusing her bleary eyes on my bleeding smile, she asked to hear my confession. The first bullet missed me, I said. The second bullet went through my upper arm. A clean shot, still hurt like fuck. Coding was needed. A single stream of clouds passed in front of the moon, as unfocused as your attention. I felt dizzy, so I sat down, leaned my back against the wall. There was blood in the glasses of milk no mothers were feeding. I fashioned crippled Madonnas from these pieces of glass and those rusty nails gathered at the shore. Inside each sculpture, I left a black pearl for you. That's why I did it. No, that's why I did it. Morphine was required. We moved around the drive-by shooting, crept in, and when we finished, we were holding her firmly. She's not mourning. The knife pierced through a Gideon Bible on the nightstand, the sound of almost bursting echoes. You now, relaxing so easily, happened all by itself, talked about it with you, on the ceiling. That's the suggestion that was meant, just for her, a relaxed state. You can see you, or attached to it, or them. Leave them grunting and filling her with need as she ran away. She couldn't get him hard, live sex show, he was ashen white, his blood on the peep show glass, Needle dangling from vein that flopped around. Too fucking high. Junk numbing, crappy climaxes. A neon vase contained the sublime pain. Leather patchworks populated the skies. The glass walls of the peep show were cleaner than usual. I was on the outside. She had opened the door for a break so we could talk. I started first. You like it in there? Yes, I do. I did my two bags up and all is fine. The viewers don't matter. It's very far away. She had the somewhat thick voice of heroin that was simultaneously frightened and lust ridden. There was laser light trapped under her flesh. Her eyes rolled back a little, her eyelids clad in black flooded slightly. Then she regained her composure. She laughed. Did you see that skag trying to blow her boyfriend in the circle? He was so high, his cock just flopped there. I stole his syringe later. It came in useful. Those patrons were ass fucked. No show today. She turned lightly and leaned into the booth. I saw a little puke shoot out. It was that clean effortless vomit that the heroin gives us. Pain had the task of keeping us together, created associations of loss, nine notes relaxing, evil energy continues, perfect boyfriend-girlfriend, literal meaning is stupid. Thank you. Wow. Wow. Thank you.